to be able to go to live on Facebook. Um, so I'm just going to do Instagram live and uh, hopefully Barbie and Beth will join us because for some reason Facebook is not letting me hook up any of my Wi-Fi connections. So sorry about that. I'm going to only be able to stream live here. Again, Facebook difficulties, but I will save the video for later and post it there. But we are going to get started. Welcome. Hello, hello. I miss you guys who are not with us. So we are going to start. Today is an arms and abs blitz. We're going to always start with a five-minute warm-up, a 15-minute circuit for strength and core. Today, arms and abs focus. And then we're going to end with a five-minute audio-guided meditation. If someone can access Facebook, can you please post? that we are on Instagram Live because Facebook is not allowing me to do the video. Thank you very much. But go ahead, we're gonna go ahead and get started. So we're gonna need a mat. We're gonna start with a five minute warm up. Let me get my clock, gang. I hope you guys are all staying safe and healthy. So let's start with the back of our mat. 30 seconds, here we go. Inhale up, exhale down, walk out, inchworm. Okay, from inchworm, Right shoulder tap, left shoulder tap, walk back, inhale up, exhale down, walk out. Go at your own pace. If you have to drop to your knees to do this shoulder tap, drop to your knees. Throughout today's class, I'm going to show you regressions, progressions. One more time, we are just starting warm up. Make sure you give yourself some time. To lubricate all the body's joints. Woo. Now right here, moving on. Inchworm, okay? Right foot, left foot, yoga squat, up, walk back. Second exercise and warm up. Inchworm, plank, step forward, step forward, yoga squat, inhale up, exhale, walk back. One more time. Inchworm, plank, squat, step, step, yoga squat, inhale up, exhale down. Moving on, third exercise in warm up. Walk out halfway, down dog, here. Kick right, kick left, walk back, stay here. Forward fold, okay, so side profile, second time. Walk out halfway, down dog, right? Kick right, kick left, walk back, stay here. One more time, I'll go the opposite way. Same, same, halfway walk out, down dog. Kick right, kick left, walk back, stay here. Inhale up, exhale down. Stay here, scapular retraction. So fourth exercise, bring it back. Squeeze shoulder blades down, head down, thumbs up, down, up. Squeeze the shoulder blades, the back muscles together. Squeeze, scapular retraction, down, up. Everything for warm up is 30 seconds. So several exercises, up, down, up. Good. Almost there, gang. Three. Squeeze. Two. Looking down at the mat. And one. Lunge to balancing stick, okay? All right leg. Right leg forward. Lunge. Reach out. Lift up. Okay? Balancing stick. Come back. Step back. Same thing, right leg, I'll show you side profile. Lunge forward, right, bend the leg, reach forward, come up, balancing stick, lift it up, and then back, step back. One more time, I'll show you this profile. Same right leg again, right leg, step forward, lunge, reach out, lift up, balancing stick. Step back, lift up. So now we got three on the left leg. So I'll show you left leg, Lunge, bend that back knee, reach up, pause, head down, back, step up. Two more. Lunge, left, bend the knee, reach, lift off, 
and then bring it back. Step up. One more time. Left leg. Lunge. Bring that knee down. Reach. Lift off. Hold. And then take it back. Push up. Okay, inhale. We're going to finish off warm up with 30 seconds of belly breathing. So I want you to think about engaging your abs and like a slingshot, you're going to be pulling your, in, your belly button in and out and you're going to go and you're gonna put your hand here. So we're gonna fire up the internal aerobic system by doing this really rapid breath, deep belly breathing for 30 seconds. In three, two, one, go. You should feel your belly going in and out. Keep going, keep going.
Ready? Good job, gang. Five, push through. Three, two, and one. Back down. Fourth exercise, chaturanga push-ups. 30 seconds. So, level one, knees, elbows back. Not out, elbows back. You're gonna lower yourself, elbows back all the way down. And then you're gonna push up. That's level one. Level two, we're gonna do it from plank. 30 seconds, ready? Up, elbows back, slow, slow. Ground, push back up off your knees, back on your toes, elbows back, chaturanga. Slow, 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 slow. Lift off on your toes, push back up, plank, chaturanga. Down, slow, slow. Good job. Lift off, back up, push up. One more time, chaturanga, slow, slow, slow. Down, here, push back, up. Last exercise in circuit one, scapular retraction from plank. So like scapular push-up. So think about doing this. See my shoulder blades, but from plank. Do what you can. So we're gonna go plank, but I'm moving your body. I want you to think dip, up, dip, up, dip. So my elbows, my arms are not bending. I'm letting my shoulder blades sink to the floor, push away. Sink to the floor, push away. Sink to the floor. It's a very small movement. If you have to drop to your knees, drop to your knees and keep doing this. Very small movement in the wrist. Shoulders drop, push up. Shoulders drop, push up. 10 seconds. Up, down, up. Sink it low, up. Tighten the core, sink it low, up. Almost there, and up. Good job. That was round one. So we got three sections. So if you need to grab a quick drink of water, grab it. Next series of exercises. We're gonna do a couple of exercises and repeat them for a four to five minute round. And again, if you wanna take this up a notch, we complete the whole circuit one time and then go back and complete the whole circuit two times. Okay, are you ready? Hustlers, elbow, elbow, palm, palm. Here we go. Let me start my timer. So, modified level one on your knees. Elbow, elbow, palm, palm. Try and alternate elbows, okay? Ready? 30 seconds, go. Elbow. Elbow. I'm switching. Elbow. Left elbow. Right elbow. Left, right, good job. And time, side plank dips. Left elbow on the ground, underneath the shoulder, legs stacked. Level one, knees here bent, hand here, and you're gonna push up and down. That's level one, up and down. So plank, side plank dips. Level two is leg straight, and you're gonna dip it out. Three, two, and one. So up, and you can do tap, reach, tap, reach, tap, reach, or hold here, help yourself lift up. Trying to get hips stacked to the sky, keeping the body in a straight line, down, up, down, push that elbow into the ground. So see how my shoulder's right along my elbow? Up, I'm not coming here or here, I'm going straight up. One more time, up, good. We have the other side. Side plank dips. Don't slip, if you need a towel under your mat, put a towel. So first line up elbow under shoulder, feet stacked. Pick your level, knees bent easier, legs straight harder, and go. Up, down. Or you can put your hands on your hip. Up, try and get a space, a big space there. Up, good. Breathe up, nice. Dig that elbow into the mat. Pike up, good. And don't forget to breathe. 
eight, six, four, three, two, one more. Up, nice. Okay, moving on. Squat hop touchdowns is our one exercise. Squat hop. You're gonna use your width of your mat. Feet together, and we're gonna hop out, touch. Hop back in. Modified step out, touch, step in. Step out, touch, step in. Pick your level, ready and go. 30 seconds, chest up, looking straight ahead, land soft, legs out, touch, legs in. Good. Right here again, push through. At any time, take it to a step out if you need to. Five, four, come on, push through. Three, two, one more. One. Good job. Okay, that whole thing, right back to the start. One more time for round two. We are doing Hustler. I'm gonna use a mat now because I'm getting slippery. So ready, and plank, go. Woo, gang. How's it feeling? Upper body, core, arms, abs. Only 30, push it through, get into a rhythm. Home stretch. Ten. One more. Time. Nice. Elbow down. Side plank dips. Ready. Important. Elbow underneath the shoulder. Feet stacked. Three, two, one. Up. Think about your, your waist, this part. Cinch it to drive that hip up. 10 down, 20 to go. Nice. Up. Breathe. Take a break when you need to, gang. Go at your own pace. Up. Good work. Three. And time. Other side. Because why? Why do we have to do the other side? What do I always say? Because <laughs> we have two sides. <laughs> Elbow underneath the shoulder. Hands up, lift legs stacked. Don't roll back or roll forward, ready? And go. Hip up, tap. Hip up, tap the ground. With that hip. Nice, up. Get it high up. No lazy hips. Dip it up. I dip, you dip, we dip. Come on. I dip, you dip, we dip. Keep pushing. Eight seconds. Couple more. Keep the legs straight. And last one. Up, oh, down. Nice. Do you remember the last one? Squat hops. Okay, here we go. Feet sucked in. Squat hop, touchdown. 30 seconds. Three. Two, go. Up. Woo. Shake it out, gang. Hopefully you have your workout beast mode music on. I learned that I can't do audio or it'll drown out my instruction. Keep pushing. Eight, six, four, three, Two, and one. Nice, grab a quick drink of water. Okay. Woo, we made it through two rounds. We got one more round. Okay, here it is. Option. If you have a band, you'll use a band. If you don't have a band, forget about it. Seated. Shoulder abduction. So, if you have a towel, you use your towel. Elbows tight. Do not let your elbows creep up. No space. Zip them in. Keep them there. This is the motion. If you have a towel, 
You're gonna try and rip this toe apart. Uh, uh, just like that, you have to make the noises. <laughs> okay, if you have a band, band around your wrist. Ready, and go, thumbs up. Out, in, out. Very little movement. Very good strengthener for the rotator cuff, the anterior delt. All the little muscles that sometimes get um, forgotten about, but they assist in everything we do with our upper body. So we wanna do these, and the beauty of these is you can do it anywhere. So if you don't have a band, you're using the towel, right? So if you have your towel, you're going here. You're trying to pull apart the towel, and then in. Pull apart the towel, and then in. Pull apart the towel, and then in. Pull, so we're working this little. So five, muscle in the front of three, two, one, okay. Second goodie for the shoulders, Y T Vs. Okay, so you can do seated, cross-legged on your toes. Give me a Y, yes you can. Drop the shoulders, down, thumbs up. Give me a T, lateral raise, okay? Give me a Y, thumbs back, out. Or a V, V, see the V? Okay, here we go. Y, shoulders drop, down. T, shoulders drop, down. V, thumbs back, like hitchhiker thumbs down. Y, drop. No shoulders to the ears. T down, V. I want you to reset at the thigh every letter. Y, shoulders drop all the way down. T, shoulders drop all the way down. V, all the way back, shoulders drop all the way down. Okay, Y. Now think about doing it without letting the shoulders come up. V, Y, T, V. 10 more seconds. Y, and again, all good things to T for your shoulders. Keep your shoulders healthy, your upper back, especially if you do a lot of office work, computer work, forward motion, moving exercise. One more set, Y, shoulders drop, T, shoulders drop, V, shoulders drop. Nice, okay, pelvic tilt and crunch. Here, lying down on your back, so it's a regular ab crunch, but what I want you to do is, there's gonna be a space here, two part crunch. I want you to tilt your pelvis down so you crush that space. Imagine there's a piece of sheet paper, folder paper underneath here. You push down on the paper, then you crunch up, shoulder blades off the mat. Ready? Relax. T tilt down, pelvic, and up. Relax. Tilt, crunch. Tilt. And I know it's hard to see it on video, but I am putting my belly button to the ground, gang, and I'm trying to drill a hole by tilting the pelvis and getting the belly button to the ground. Tilt, up, tilt, up, tilt, up, tilt, up, keep going. Tilt, up, we're almost there, 15 seconds. Pelvic tilt and ab crunch. Now to make it more spicy, you do tilt, crunch, reach, one inch. Tilt, crunch, reach, one inch, if you can. Tilt, crunch, reach, lift, one inch. One more time. Tilt, crunch, reach, one inch. Okay. Cobra. We got two more, gang. Cobra. Right here. Lie down, soup up, prone position, flatten your back, okay? Hands right by your chest, elbows wing back. All you're gonna try and do is use your upper back strength to bring your chest, your boobs off the floor, okay? Ready, and go, up. Your legs stay on the ground, down. Deep breath, inhale, exhale. Inhale, up, look up. Down. Inhale, exhale. Okay, again, for the rest, now go at your own pace. Up, and then down. Up, and then down. Up. Little movement. So good for your posture, your spine. Motion is lotion, game. Up, down. Lubricating all the joints in the upper back. Up. Three more. Two more. Up. One more. Up. And down. Nice. Hollow 
rocks. Two more exercises again, two more. Hollow rocks is here, legs out, hands overhead. So I'm gonna give you version level one. Level one is knees bent, hands here, and all you need to do is rock back and forth. Level one, okay? Level one, shoulder blades off the mat. Level two, your legs are out, your hands are overhead, and what we're trying to do is start a seesaw. Get a seesaw, little movement while keeping the belly flat to the ground. So pick your level, we're going in five, four, three, two, and one. It's very small. And if you want, you can just hold it here in this hollow position. Rock. Little. Breathe. If at any time you need to, you can bend your knees and hold it here or rock it here. Five, four, three, two, and time. Woo, that's a good burner. Last one, game. Last one. Plank walkouts for 30 seconds. So, we're gonna go here, ready? Standing, inhale up, exhale. Walk out to plank, okay? So I'm gonna move back. Walk out to plank, and then walk out one, two, three, four more. So now your hands are away from your shoulders. You see that? And walk back. Stay here. Okay, so right here, right? Plank, walk out to plank, and then go one, two, three, four, five. Hands way farther away, butt down, okay? Bring it back. Nice. Again, inhale up, exhale, plank walk out. So we're trying to get farther away from the body every time. So we're gonna walk out to plank where shoulders are under, palms are underneath shoulders, and we're gonna go one, two, away, three, four, five. Woo, how far can you go? Hold it, and then walk it back up. One more time, gang. I want you to challenge yourself. Test your, your further, the distance away from your plank. Inhale up. Last one, best one. Walk down. Right here. Okay, plank. How far can you go? Little. Tight tummy, little. Belly bump, pull the spine, little. Oh, it's getting away. It's getting away. Now hold it. 10, nine, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Drop to your knees. Woo, push back here. Come here. Upward dog here. Stretch out those abs. Head down. Push back child's pose, forehead to the floor. And then bring it up. Nice work, gang. You have reached our cool down. We're going to spend five minutes of active meditation. This is so important. I know if you have to go, please try and stay with us for a couple of minutes just to re-energize the body, let the heart rate come down, and just give yourself some mindfulness and peacefulness um, during the next several minutes, okay? So do what you need to do. I'm going to turn off the lights.
Focus on your inhale and your exhale. Slow and controlled throughout the body. Let's start at your head. I want you to relax your face. Relax your cheeks. And take a couple of swallows so that your jaw loosens, relaxing your tongue at the bottom of your throat. Let's pay attention to your shoulders. Relax your shoulders away from the ears. Do you notice any tension in your neck or shoulder area? If so, gently roll your head left to right, slow and controlled. And focus your breath on these areas where you may experience a bit of tension or tightness or discomfort. On your next inhale, I want you to fill up your rib cage with that breath. Let it rise, rise, and then a deep exhale. That breath travels out the belly button. Again, deep breath, inhale, let the chest rise, fill up with that deep belly breathing air. And then exhale, all that air, out through your belly button, over your hips. Let's focus on your thighs, the front of your legs. Relax your knees. Relax your calves. And let's center our attention on your ankles. How do your ankles feel? Let's rotate your feet in from your ankles so that your big toes are kissing each other. And then let your ankles roll away so that your pinky toes are kissing the floor. Let's do that one more time. Ankle rolls, big toes come together. And then on your exhale, ankle rolls, pinky toes touch the floor. Settle into a comfortable place and let your feet relax. Through guided meditation, you can keep your eyes open or closed. Let's gently take your hands to the sides of your body, wiggling out your fingers. I want you to feel the floor beneath you and grasp the floor with your fingertips. I want you to think about radiating your energy into the ground and absorbing the energy back into your body. On your deep breath, inhale. I want you to gently roll to one side of your body, using your hands to cradle your head and hanging out here for a little bit. If your mind is wandering, thinking about other things. Bring your breath back, bring your mind back, using your breath into this present moment. How do you feel in a sideline position? Are you calm? Are you relaxed? Are you stressed? Do you have anxiety? If some of those things arise for you, I want you to recognize them and then focus on using your breath to let the feeling go. Using your hands, gently roll up to a seated position, however you feel comfortable. You can sit cross-legged or on your heels. And let's take a couple of breaths together. So inhale up, grab that air, hold that air down, exhale, head down. Inhale up, hold that air, Exhale down, release that air. One more time, inhale up, exhale. 
So today, let's finish with those rapid belly breathings. Okay, we're gonna finish. So the best way for this is if you can, sit on your knees. And again, we started with that rapid belly breathing, slingshot, the breath is from the belly button. Your cheeks are narrow and you're gonna really force the, a lot of air under a very small circumference of your cheeks together. Okay, so we're gonna do 30 seconds. I want you to put your hand on your belly to feel that pump, 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 and go. Thanks guys.